We've got some Simpson URFP foundation plates here. So basically what it does is it connects the concrete foundation to your mud sill right here. So that in the event of an earthquake, this concrete's doing this or this, and this thing is supposed to help secure your mud sill and everything above it from slipping off. So basically this house, uh, this concrete kind of comes up a bit past where this mud sill is and you're gonna be driving a bunch of two and a half inch screws into your mud sill. And so like if you come up here and you get a screw in there, it's gonna start splitting that wood. So basically I have a hammer drill here and I use a chisel to take away enough so that this guy can sit nice and pretty in this thing. So that when I drive in those two and a half inch screws, it's not gonna be doing anything bad. And then once I've done that, uh, I come in and I have a half inch bit that I drive four and a quarter inch deep into the concrete, again, using the roto hammer. And you can leave this in place. I'll try to show you guys how I do this. Um, and so once all of that is done, it's uh, a matter of uh, then coming in with the Titan HD bolts. You can use whatever bolts you want, but this is what Simpson is and I'm staying in Simpson land right now, so. I'm gonna use these guys, and this is a 19 mil socket here on an impact gun. We'll drive those in, and uh, then we'll have one in place. And then the spacing on these guys is you need to have one at least a foot, or within a foot of the ending of your mud sill, and the wherever these mud sill plates end. So like, I need to have one at least a foot at the end of that right over there. Um, and uh and then every six feet at least so this is just about six feet between this one and this guy so i'm gonna come in here like this and uh i'll screw in just two two and a half to hold it in place then i'll drill out the holes for the concrete bolts and then once we do that um then we'll just finish screwing these in so i'll show you guys how that all looks uh in a sec Go. Job done.